music, it's this intangible thing. If you can look to be moved by something, that's really important. The beauty about a presentation like this with so many people from different aspects of music careers is that you can see how it's all connected. And these recurring themes throughout everything we say is about connecting with each other and connecting with other people. And that's how we take this intangible thing that goes out in the air that we want to influence and affect everybody to be better. Thomas. I'm a music industry studies major with a minor in interactive marketing and law. So I actually attended the sessions at NAM two years ago. From that experience and having the actual specific information that was discussed in this panel today, I felt was the most beneficial thing that any music business student could have. Everyone should actually attend the sessions. I think it is one of the most beneficial things for college students and anyone in the industry looking to expand their knowledge and gain insight into the experiences that veterans have. My name is Jacob Hatfield. I am a senior and I'm in the Music Industry Studies program here at CSUN. Well, I think the most important thing I took away was that I am in charge of my success. And this is something that was preached throughout the whole program and something that you can't just learn easily. So that was a real takeaway for me was just that I'm in charge of my destiny and that I can be the captain of my ship. My name is Jordan Smith. I am a senior here at CSU Northridge and I'm studying music industry studies. I attended the sessions panel today because of all the great things I was hearing about it and they had like these great posters outlining what they were going to be talking about like management, contracts, and tribe. Like who is in your tribe? Who's going to push you and move you forward to keep you determined in this crazy industry? And that's just something I really resonated with. So it's about influence. There are some players I know who are very famous, excellent players. Nobody follows them because they haven't done anything to get themselves out there. So really, that's what you're looking for. If you want to move into that aspect of relationship with companies, you need to be able to offer that type of thing. My name is Hannah Lewis. I'm a junior, and I'm studying media composition here at CSUN. My biggest takeaway is probably that it can still be about the music, even if you've been in the industry for years and years. We get this idea that maybe after we leave school, we might get jaded or we might make it more about the business. Hearing these people speak really makes it clear that they still really, really care about what they do and they still are doing it for the reason that they went into it. So that was really inspiring to me. When we start our careers, it's really important that we grow together and we have great friends who are in the same mindset and who eventually we might be working with. Mm -hmm. And all of a sudden, this sort of fraternity or brotherhood or sisterhood of people who will help each other as we go and as we grow into our next level of artistry. I think the key for me is that a life in music is honorable. If you make a life in music, it's going to be great. I wish everyone here great success, but not even financial. I'm talking about the success of being someone who has music in their life and who can make a life in music. That's glorious.